Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play Goosebumps the Game. In the previous episode, we finished everything up at the mall and we're about to take on the last room. We called R.L. Stein and he said to keep Slappy distracted until he gets here. So, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and save because I haven't done this in a while. And we're going to go talk to Slappy. Seal your nerves, you press on the bookstore and whatever waits beyond. The bookstore is bathed in darkness. There's a sense of absence that your mind races to fill. There's a whole bunch of Goosebumps books sitting here. A number of Goosebumps look books lie discarded in a pile on the floor. Dummy, take a look at him. The figure on the floor looks like a ventriloquist puppet. Is it Slappy? Of course not. It's just a normal one. No, this puppet has different hair and everything. Where's Slappy? Shadows hang from every surface. Perfect hiding place for every nightmare you've ever had. Well, we can try and leave. No such luck? I don't know. Where's he at? There he is. I'm so glad you can make it. What? Who are you? Give name, don't give name. Don't give name? I'm the kid who's gonna stop you once and for all. Oh, well, it's a pleasure to meet you. What's your plan? How are you going to stop me? Stammer it out, hammer at home. I called R.L. Stein and he's already on his way. You what? What did you tell him exactly? Everything? I told him what you have planned. I told him everything. Foolish child, you have no idea what I have planned. Passive. And whose fault is that? I might have a better idea if you just told me. Fair enough. I've sent several messages. He's sure to hear over television, radio, and my blog. Any one of them will lead him here, where my monster pals are converging. Call foul, guilt trip? Call foul. This seems like unfair odds. All those monsters against one guy? He deserves at least a fighting chance. No, you know who deserves a chance? Me, and I'm taking it today. Let's see, Stein, try to stop me. Single him out with what army? Is that what you need all those monsters to do is the dirty work for you? Speaking of monsters, where'd they go? The mall was crawling with them. How'd you get here? Be honest, be modest. Be honest? I took them all out, one by one. Guess those Goosebumps favorites couldn't could have used a rewrite. Ooh. Get a new writer, kid. You're not as clever as you think. Clever, clumsy. Well, that is, huh. There's anything you wanted to talk about? Blah, blah, blah. This has gone on long enough, and I have important things to do. It's time to say goodnight. I guess I died. Slapping lunges towards you, determined to put your lights out. Run or fight back? Fight back? You stand your ground, bring your arm forward, ready for attack. You aren't sure how to fight an evil dummy, but what choice do you have? Just as Slappy reaches striking distance, a voice moves through the store and stops the puppet in his tracks. Not so fast. What? But how? Daniel filled me in on your little plan. It's impressive, but unfortunately not impressive enough. No, it's too early. Nothing's ready yet. You, you gotta give me a redo. You've done more than that. More than enough damage for one day, Slappy. It's time to go back in the book. No, you can't do this. You created me. Why do you just... What? the? Why do you just... Why do that? Just to hide me away. Like some mistake. I am not a mistake. My books were meant to entertain kids. That's what you monsters are for. The only mistake was letting you out into the world where you can hurt people. You'll regret this, Papa. Next time I won't be playing a game. Next time, Slappy will be the puppet master. So he let them out of the book? Shut up and get in the book. You go, R.L. Stein. You go. Hello, Pharaoh. What are you doing, bubs? I got my doggo. And there I am. You're R.L. Stein. We got 
not the living dummy's night. It's only an nightmare. You want it only. Thanks for distracting Slappy. Oh, you were listening? Had to make an entrance. Good writing is all about timing. And it's time we put these monsters away for good. Every R every story R.L. Stein types comes to life, so he can keep them locked, but Slappy had gotten loose and released the rest of the monsters as well. We followed Mr. Stein around town as he trapped each monster inside the book it came from. It took most of the evening, but after he trapped the final goal, it was time to say goodbye. Thanks again for your help, but I must be going. My daughter and I need to reach Madison by Friday. Daughter? Madison, like, in Delaware? Madison, I said nothing. Forget everything you heard. Time to go. Hey, Mom, sorry it's so late. Chad and I were about to head home. Oh, I bet you were. You get back here this minute! Uh, we had the craziest day. You wouldn't believe. Save it, I don't want excuses. I want to know what on earth you did to the house. I mean, honestly, Daniel, I expect this kind of thing from Chad, but my goodness, the whole house is a mess. Everything is on the floor. You left the fridge open. I can't even talk about upstairs. I'm so angry. Just wait until your father gets home. We're gonna have a serious talk about video game privileges. No, not the video game privileges. Look at that face. <laughs> and Chad's all like, oh, it's not on me. Well, anywho. So that was Goosebumps the game. It's pretty much the same even if you have a female protagonist. It's just that the female pops up in the last scene. There's legitimately nothing different other than that. And that in chat says little sis instead of little bro or whatever it is. But for the most part, it was a pretty fun game. Now, like I said, I originally played it on the PS4, and I already have all the achievements for it. I got the platinum trophy and everything. Because I sat through one night, and I was just like, let's just do everything. And I did. I, I can vouch for it. I, I can post my achievement score. But I'm not going to, because I'm lazy and I don't do, like, after editing. Eh, what can I say? Ah, sorry, I took a drink there. But yeah, that was Goosebumps the game. I hope you enjoyed it. It was requested, and I've been planning on doing it in a while. Uh, the next Goosebumps game I plan on doing, I was asked to redo Goosebumps Horrorland for the PS2. I was actually asked to do the DS one, so if I were to redo the game, I'd probably do the DS game. Just because, uh... I have a weird thing about redoing games. Like, instead of redoing something, I could spend that time putting up new content. If that makes any sense. But... I don't know, I just have a weird thing about redoing games. I understand the quality of the PS2 one was terrible. So it would be nice to go through and do it, and I already plan on redoing some games, so that might be on the list of redos, but, eh, I just don't know. I don't know. But anywho, the, uh, the next Goosebumps game I plan on doing, uh, for this Halloween will be Attack of the Mutant. I plan on doing that for this October, which... I, uh, I understand it is January, almost. It's actually December 26th. It's the day after Christmas now. So that's always fun. Uh, but... You know, I plan on doing, uh, Attack of the Titan. Thanks for playing! Um... For th this, this Halloween. I was, I actually managed to get, a uh, a few new horror games. But, yes. Yeah, hello. That wasn't a fake ventriloquist, dummy. Look at that. It was alive. Ooh, spooky. And I think I've already mentioned the fact that I believe the, uh, the movie, the, the game, this game was actually a prequel to the movie. So, go ahead, go watch the movie now, and it'll all connect, clearly. But anyway. If you like the video, please like, subscribe. I hope you like the game. And go ahead and check out some of my other games. I've done uh, Goosebumps Horrorland for the PS2. I did Inner Horrorland for the old Windows XP, I think. I did that one. We've got Goosebumps the game. And if you're watching this in the, f 
the future, and I've already done Attack the Mutant. You can check that one out too. So, uh, other than that, check out my channel. You know, do you? You're you're a cool guy. You know what you're doing. Or cool gal. You know, can't leave out can't leave out the ladies. But I I hope to see you all real soon. So, see you all then.